So today we're going to the Warp Tour. We're gonna load up the Ford Focus with all the things the ambassadors need out on the road, all the educational material, but what they really need is some coffee. They've gone 18 days straight with no day off, really out there educating people, so we're also gonna stop and uh, get them a little treat. Play artist, so long Arletta. Playing artist, so long Arletta. Keeper Rest has been on the Warp Tour. This is our 10th year, it's our largest outreach. Uh, we have a huge tent, it's called the Keep of Rest Girls Garage, and underneath it we host several of our programs. Uh, my name is Kevin Lyman, the founder and producer of the Vans Warp Tour. My mother uh, passed away from breast cancer, or, or the results of uh, breast cancer. Definitely aware of it, had a lot of friends go through it, and uh, you know, it's something that can be treated if caught early. I know that, you know, sometimes people are talking about research or education, but I think if you can educate teens at a younger age, amongst other things that we do out here, Hey, maybe they're gonna, you know, it'll save a few lives. My name is Kyle Kraft. I'm the Keeper Breast Non Toxic Revolution ambassador out here on the Vans Warp Tour. I got involved with the Keeper Breast and the Non Toxic Revolution because my grandmother had breast cancer, and it's definitely in my family. Um, and so I feel that it's important for young people to really be aware of it and to lower their risk any way they can. The girls' garage is a big, giant striped tent in. You can recognize it, you see it right when you walk into Warp Tour and you know, Keep Abreast has our presence there for 10 years. It's really cool because we're super lucky to have this huge tent. We're actually able to host acoustic sets and signings at our booth and so a lot of the bands really want to support Keep Abreast and they come in and bring in their fans and then their fans get to get educated on what Keep Abreast is about. So Long Arletta is playing in our tent today which is a band that follows the tour and they approached us they wanted to get more involved in Keep Abreast. I really hope that what kids get out of the girls garage and their experience there is to really be their own activist and that they have control over you know, what they're doing to their bodies and they can go home and take that with them and make smart choices.